finish this sentence. So what you, what you, what you want? Gonna get it together, watch it. Gonna get it together, my bell, like my bell. I got the ear communication. Wow. My bell, I got the ear communication. Mi panza me tiene confianza. Trae a la esposa del chef que quiero besarla. Tenedor, cuchillo, cuchara. Listo, amigo, esto es. Yum, yum, extravaganza. Yeah. Tacos con Tom Holland y Jake Gyllenhaal. Creo que leí mal. Tacos con Tom Holland y Jake Gyllenhaal. Mmm, qué rico. Tacos. Y Jake Gyllenhaal también. Para que dejen de estar comentando. ¿Qué pasó, Curry? La invitas a puras youtubers. Les trajimos a Spider-Man y a Misterio a una mesa a comer tacos. Y sí, es el cliché del mexicano con los extranjeros. Pero no les íbamos a llevar a Xochimilco a que conozcan cómo nos conquistaron con espejos y ojos verdes. Así que los llevamos al califa. Tom Holland y Jake Gyllenhaal están promocionando la película Spider-Man Far From Home y hacer guapos. La película se estrena el 5 de julio y su gordo favorito se sentó con ellos a practicar su inglés y su mala digestión. Así que ya sabes, si vienen tus amigos extranjeros, no les enseñas groserías. Mejor llévalos a comer, pues, tacos. Perdón como polita. Bienvenidos a esta emisión de Ñam Ñam Extravaganza, donde todo se trata de tragar y platicar. El día de hoy nos encontramos en eh, los tacos, el califa de reforma. Estos tacos son bastante populares en la Ciudad de México porque es como el taco pop, el taco fresón al que llevas al turista para que no haya riesgo de que le caiga pesado. Y precisamente me buscaron para eh, pasear aquí a dos turistas que vienen a promocionar una película. No puedo decir aquí el nombre de la película en fuerte porque ya hay gente acechándolos. Eh, su nombre es básicamente eh, Jake Jinko y Tom Holland. Nada más, nada más voy a estar tragando con ellos. Soy casi no estoy nervioso como podrán ver pues eh, nada comamos tacos con ellos acompáñenme you know what's you, you know spicy I love spicy food yeah how spicy can you handle I can't handle spicy food so. like Mexico City spicy? so yeah, so no, no. sorry guys so That's so right, sorry man. so sorry, sorry. Man. I mean so sorry I'm, I'm not from England I'm, I'm like it's Santos o'clock time <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> How you guys up? Hey man, good. Hey buddy, how you doing? You do, you do movies and stuff, right? We do movies, yeah. A little bit. Sometimes. Do you, have you tried Mexican tacos? Uh, um, yeah. Yeah. Like from Mexico City? Like, have you tried that? Yeah. Version? yeah? I think so. Last yeah. time I was here in Mexico, I tried ah, so this tacos. Oh, right, so this is not good for you. This is like... But we ate them with... I didn't eat them with, uh, like, someone from Mexico. So maybe we were doing it wrong. Yeah, yeah. but I'm not from Mexico. I'm from Brazil. Oh, you're from Brazil. No, I'm just kidding. No, oh. let's, see, let's, see, let's try the tacos. Let's try the tacos. This is, is going to be a slippery slide, my friend. <laughs> How spicy are you willing to go? Is what I'm No, asking. really. How spicy are you willing to go? Um... I mean, this is like, I can give you like, it is like this... In yeah, order of yeah, spiciness. Yeah, 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 this is, a, this, is, this is kind of sweet actually. No, are, you, are you sure? How spicy? It is spicy. Well, not for me, maybe for you it will be... No, it's fine. It's fine? Yeah. Really? Well, wait, it might, have, it might linger in the... Did you get one of the seeds? Because the seeds Whoa. are... <laughs> Oh, this is good. I'm really good. You good? I feel like a plank spot. Well, take him. Well, you just grab this. Look. You just grab it. Try it. Oh, oh. Mmm. That's really good. It's all. It's breaking apart. Oh, it's cheese. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Another Marvel movie. It is your first one, but it's my first Marvel movie. But it's like. You have a ton of Marvel movies and part of the job in Marvel, as I can see, it is, it is like 10% on a set, 90% doing press around the world. Like, how many of these interviews you do when you make a, a Marvel movie? This is, this is almost day one, right? We this came to Mexico City first. Yeah, because we started in Mexico City. Such a big, there's so many Marvel fans here. That's, that's what I've been told, such huge fans here. And, so we um, came here first. It's the first time I've done an interview in a restaurant. Really? Yeah. I only do interviews in restaurants. Really? Is yeah. that in your writer? Yeah, this is a first for me. Thank you very much. Yeah, That's I feel cool. Like... <laughs> is this pineapple? Is that uh, what that yeah, is? you can take it off or leave it. It's like a I'm huge sorry? discussion in Mexico. Like, don't put a pineapple on the taco al pastor. And some really? people are like, put the pineapple on. Put the pineapple on. 
a pineapple and pizza. That isn't that spicy. It's actually, you lied to us. It was actually invented mm. in, um, it's not that crazy spicy, in Canada. So, how many interviews you do during a, a Marvel tour for a new movie? I think the most I've done in a day is like 70. 70 in a day? I've done 81 in a record not for a Marvel movie. Really? It was for a smaller movie that I, I wanted everyone to see, but so you had to make sure you talked to everyone. I, did, I was like, literally, some guy who wasn't even a journalist, I was like, let's do an interview. <laughs> What was the movie? End of Watch. That oh, I love that yeah. movie. You do like do movies a year. How, how do you manage your time to do so? There's a lot of time. Sometimes they're shorter. Sometimes you shoot them in two a yeah. month. Sometimes you shoot them in six months. So, so um, you can realize I'm shaking. And this is like regular for you. Like a lot of interviews go like this. Like, hi guys, nice to meet you. How do you deal with calming the people? How, how do you deal with that? <laughs> uh, like, is it part of your job too? Make the interview yeah. go, yeah, 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 or... Don't you feel yeah, like, techniques. don't you feel whenever you're nervous, like the calmer someone else is, the more nervous you get? Mm. That's definitely my experience. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, you don't care what it is. I'm, I'm just, just like, really hungry. <laughs> He's so hungry. You join it? <laughs> I'm just really hungry. Pineapple or no pineapple? Pineapple, big time. Pineapple yeah, too? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I agree. Your pineapple? Yeah. Yes! Three pineapple, guys. Did you do the really alien? Yeah, I did, yeah. Back in the day. I didn't fail to jump from Billy Elliot to Spider Man. Not well, that different, right? <laughs> you just like, go like. It's like dance, it's like physical. And Dancing for me has been like the most valuable thing I've ever learned in this industry because a lot of the characters I play are so physical and yeah. it's been such a like good sort of skill to have to be able to kind of manipulate your body in, in ways that a dancer does. So it's been super helpful. Which one is more difficult, uh, Spider Man or Rihanna? You mean doing the song, the, the song, Rihanna's song, right? Oh, you were damn serious at the Rihanna beat. You were like. <laughs> yeah, right. That's. He's just give him a second. All right, give him a second. Sorry. Oh man. What was your question, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> Who's the hardest, Spider-Man or Rihanna? A Rihanna song. Performing Rihanna. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Performing Rihanna. Yeah. <laughs> Which is more difficult? Performing Rihanna. Oh, or... oh, oh. Yeah. Oh, uh, oh. I just wanted to be clear about oh, that. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I'm the one. Oh, oh, yeah. I even. Sorry. I got no. <laughs> this is such a mess, oh. man. <laughs> oh, let's move on. Another, you need another taco. Yeah, I think oh, I need another one. I'm going to finish oh. my taco. Oh, oh. Well, you two hooligans have been doing whatever you've been doing. I'm going to finish up my tacos and I'm enjoying them. <laughs> <laughs> you got sauce all over your fingers. Mm. I can answer the question for you for him a little bit, which is that yeah. to watch him do Spider-Man. Spider-Man is so to watch him do it every day for months and months and months. It's so physical. I mean, he does so many of his own stunts. I mean, there's incredible stunt team, incredible stunt men who do a lot of work too. But the work he does is so amazing. And then he's doing scenes and he's improving and he's like he's in the story and trying to figure out the story at the same time. It's a lot. Like his heart is in the movie, so. What no. do you say about him? You got to give it back some. I don't. It's an amazing. I mean, I'm sorry. I was I was in my pack. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> he was in his taco. He's amazing. I, like, I've Sorry, always man. dreamed of working with him, and here we are eating tacos in Mexico. I'm good, thank you, buddy. Put a little bit on your taco. Mm. No. no. What's the worst stand-up moment you've ever had on stage? Oh, that's a good question. Like, what's oh. the worst heckle you've had? There was a band that was going to play after me. Uh, Ranchero band. Yeah. And at some point, it was like. Shut up that clown! Bring the band again! You know, just like... Aw, oh, dude. It wasn't even funny. You have, you have some stuff on your phone. Thank you, uh, thank you, Jake. No problem. That sucks, you, man. This is like, there's nothing worse than people who don't tell people when they have stuff on I'm not supposed to, I get too nervous. Can you imagine, it was just like... If I just, if I was like, talking the whole time and you guys were... <laughs> I would totally leave you. Yeah, I else? totally wouldn't help you. <laughs> what a friend. So at what point your interviews got like repetitive? Like Well it's funny, the first interview is always really fun. You're like, oh I really enjoy talking about the movie. And then the second interview feels like you have date you're having deja vu. Because you're like, wait a minute, I just said this. 
Am I answering the same question twice? So, like, you, you'll start to steal each other's answers as well. You'll slowly start to, like, the journalist will ask you a different question, but from the interview before. And you feel a little bit like, did he notice? Is he going to think I'm a jerk for stealing it? <laughs> but usually the other guy is just happy because he doesn't have to I'm answer your question. I don't have to yeah. say it again. <laughs> In the next interview, you steal that one again yep. from you? Yeah. yeah. Day off tomorrow in the morning. <laughs> what should we do? Um, tacos with me again. I can give okay. you a whole trip. You have free morning tomorrow? We have a free morning tomorrow. Oh, that what do you recommend good. we should do? Go to the pyramids. Go yeah. to the pyramids? So what what is that? Kind of What's on top? Is that lard? Is, uh, is that fried lard? Meat, chicharron, and longaniza. Which translates to? Uh, meat, chicharron, oh, longaniza. <laughs> okay, all right. You should give it a try. Now you go first, bro. I'm cool. you, you go first, bro. I'll just smash the tacos. This looks good. This is cheap. This is, looks really good. <laughs> That's called volcano. It's like a, a volcano? Yeah. Should I, how I'll do I? Some. I'll try some. Just bite it out of the Break off a little it piece? Off. Yeah. How can you turn down tortilla, cheese, <laughs> oh, what is this cheese melted made of? cheese, it's like, and, and meat? Oh, it's like the, the basics. Let's see. Yeah, mm, yeah, that's that really bad. good. Oh, so, that is really good. Probably one of my own. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I like I like sharing with Tom better. I don't know. It just tastes better. Can I share with you? Yeah, it dive in, better. bro. It does taste better. I mean, if I look into your eyes while I'm doing it, mm. it's like loud. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding, man. Just kidding. <laughs> What's the deal with making a Marvel movie that has such a such an aggressive fandom? Are you nervous about your work? Or are you like quiet and be like, you you watch the movie and you'll see. Because you know that fans can be like tough, tough. Yeah, but they're also so supportive. They're also so loving. They're so fans. great. Yeah, I mean, so far they've been so great, so supportive, and it's also a, it's an interesting journey because I feel like this character is not is so different from. Yeah. It's like different in that it's different from the comics, you know. And, yeah. and I think people think of him to be one way, but I think the way he's been portrayed in the movie is gonna be surprise people. So yeah, that's exciting. But I don't really ever think about it like that. I'm just excited to be a part of it. It's a, it's a really cool franchise. And you can he's tell made that fans me. are excited to find out what your character's about. Because no one really knows, if you're not a huge fan of Spider-Man, no one really knows anything about yeah, Mysterio. And I think yeah. it's going to be an exciting kind of new adventure for fans to kind of go on. And what I always say is like we don't present these movies to the fans, we share them with the fans because they're a much of this they're a much a bigger part of this process as we are. It's always just so fun like going on this roller coaster with the fans. Alright, so you wanna do the dynamic where you do uh, where we switch the interviews. Okay. And uh, you you're gonna do the interview, I'm gonna be you, and you're gonna ask the questions they're always asking you and same with you. You guys okay. are with that? So I'm gonna yeah. be the journalist. Finish, finish this sentence. So what you, what you, what you want? Gonna get it together, watch it. Gonna get it together, my bell, like my bell. I got the ear communication. Wow. My bell, I got the ear communication. Shout out to Q-Tip, it's a collaboration he made in this album with the BC Amazing. Boys. But the I, no, no, Please don't ask me to do that. <laughs> That's my first question. I, like, I think I, 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 we're, 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 we're three, three much killed guys. my first question, so. We're three white guys. We're the Beastie Boys. We're the Beastie Boys. Yeah. We're the Beastie Boys. <laughs> <laughs> Well, so what's switch. your question? Let's oh, switch. we're switching. Oh, okay. yeah, we're switch. switching. Oh, we have seats? to switch. So where are you from, mate? England, mate. Yeah, whereabouts in England? Oh, oh, I just f***ed up with this in uh, <laughs> this bit, uh, London. Oh, London, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Do you know whereabouts in London? Oh, you, 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 you know, you know the town, you know the, the whereabouts, uh, you know the... The closest uh, yeah, dancing theaters. You you always want to dance, dancing right? Theaters? Yeah, yeah, that dancing. dancing yeah, yeah. Where you? Yeah, that's dance. where. Yeah, that's you're from. Yeah, yeah. that's, that's where you're from, from a dancing yeah. theater. What was it like working with uh, with Ryan Gosling? Oh, Ryan is an amazing guy. Ryan, Ryan. like uh, he's always <laughs> so into interviews. He's such a nice guy. I mean, Ryan, uh, say it for yourself, Ryan. Ryan I mean, we both, like, we both we both are from evolved, dancing schools. Sure. From dancing schools. So Disney we grew school. up from dancing theater. Yeah, you know, it's fantastic. And how does it feel for you to play um, Aquaman? Oh, I mean, uh, we can talk about Aquaman with you guys. Is that? A, is oh that yeah, a, yeah, 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 no problem. Because you are Aquaman, right? Can, can you say DC? DC. Can, is that a thing? You don't get like... Yeah, the, the DC Comics. Did you enjoy making the movie? Uh, now, I'm, now I'm Jason Momoa? Yes. Yeah, you know, I'm a 
No, I'm just sucking. <laughs> Want to switch? All right. Are you still uh, Tom? Who, who am I? <laughs> You're who me. Am I? <laughs> and I'm you? And I'm Jean Valjean. Who am I? You're Jean Valjean. 24601. Okay. I'm Hugh Jackman. So you oh, are me now? Or am I'm I Jake Gyllenhaal. Uh, who are you? Vamos a hacerlo otra vez. ¿Quieres bien? Ahora, ven acá. Tú eres tú y yo soy yo. ¿Yo soy yo? Jake, Matt, Ricardo. Okay. Right, so uh, Chilango, uh, quick uh, Mexican. So, wait, okay. ¿cómo estás? Bien, bien. ¿Y tú? Oh, ok. David, dos tacos al pastor, por favor. Dos cerveza, por favor. Dos chelas, dos chelas. Oh. Dos chelas, ¿qué es eso? Dos chelas, compa. Dos chelas, compa, ¿qué es eso? Dos beers. Dos beers. Right, let's end it up. I'm sorry, I'm so tired. <laughs> anyway, thanks so much, man. Thank you very much. Thanks for your Beastie Boys rendition. Thank you very much. Yeah. Esta edición de Ñam Ñam Extravaganza eh, Probablemente el episodio en el que más nervioso he estado eh, Me perdí en un desastre bastante divertido Felicidades al Califa en sus 25 años Gracias por prestarnos sus instalaciones Y pues nada, eh, temblando voy a mi casa Similar esto eh, Por cierto eh, Jack Gyllenhaal hizo un comentario sobre mi padre Los Beastie Boys Y en un momento dijo que los tres éramos los Beastie Boys No sé, voy a dejar esto sobre la mesa Thank you very much. No, was, thanks uh, for having us. Maybe the weirdest really interview fun. I've ever done. I'm, I, I think I'm I would agree with you. I'm say that. not weirdest, but most confusing. <laughs> yeah. Most confusing. Absolutely. Yeah. I am. I have, I've come here a lot more confused than when I got here. So I thank you for that. No, right. Yeah. Because I literally have no idea who I am right now. Oye, tranquilo. No te pases de listo conmigo, muchacho.